what is engineering if you look at it core uh, basically it's nothing but a combination of mathematics and physics i mean no matter what you do how how much you are, uh, ever you try it is simply a combination of mathematics and physics so somebody who knows good mathematics physics and to some extent chemistry and biology the basic subjects uh, that drive anything that we are aware of um, is sufficient to understand many more things that within engineering so you uh, equip yourself uh, when you know we want our students to basically go through a curriculum that is very strong in these basics and uh, specialize in certain topics and of course mechanical engineers get to specialize topics in mechanical engineering and civil engineering and so on when they move into say a higher uh, higher order i mean in third year fourth years what they will try to do is actually look at electives that are coming from again different departments perhaps at that time maybe they are interdisciplinary i mean those subjects themselves will require knowledge of uh, more than just mechanical engineer for a mechanical engineering student uh, so the innovations we are trying to do in curriculum is like that i mean have a strong basic that is common curriculum for uh, all the branches and then uh, towards the end they are going to again get back and, and look at some some of the uh, subjects that are interdisciplinary in nature in the middle they will of course specialize few topics in within their uh, uh, course of interest <music> collaboration with mit x uh, this is basically a course uh, work that uh, mit students and other students go through Uh, these are as far as we are concerned supplementary material that we use for our basic classes you know specifically in maths and certain certain subjects and other uh, areas also uh, physics and uh, engineering to some extent but mostly mathematics and physics where the students get a chance to look at uh, the material that MIT X provides i mean this includes lectures uh, and exercises so the exercises of course you can imagine basically this is prepared by MIT so the, the standards are going to be pretty high so uh, it will also put the pressure on our faculty members to actually keep up with that particular standard and it's a nice model in my opinion basically what we teach within the classroom is supplemented by this